And dentists are warning parents may soon have to pay much more for a checkup. Australia's peak dental body says the health minister has indicated she's going to scrap a program providing free care for more than one million children. Here's Adam Todd. The only thing more painful than a visit to the dentist is the bill. One appointment can cost hundreds of dollars. So the government provides free dental care for more than one million children. But that could be about to change. It looks to us as if the child dental benefit schedule is facing the axe. Dentists say the health minister has told them the program isn't an effective use of money. The scheme provides $1,000 per child every two years, with a budget of $2.7 billion. So far, one million children have taken advantage, but that's only 30% of eligible kids. Dentists say the lower take-up is due to poor promotion. And with news 50% of young children have tooth decay, they say early care is more important than ever. Well, there's a link between dental health and general health and, and dental health, oral health, is an important part of, of general health and wellbeing. It is a shocking thing to think that this government would rather take money away from looking after kids' teeth than go after multinational tax avoiders. A spokesman for the health minister says no decisions have yet been made. The minister merely pointed out that a well-funded program wasn't meeting its aims and there may be a better way to target funding. More details are expected in coming months. Adam Todd, 10 Eyewitness News.